And I'm back with our special guest co-host today, Rachel Carlson of Yelp Pittsburgh. And in today's Yelp segment, we are saying cheers to National Beer Day. I'm ready. I'm ready Sunday. too. Yes. We've been talking about this. Yeah. I know, we've been talking it up. We have a lot of really great choices. And this is not the first time I've done beer and mm -hmm. I did not have to repeat any of them. Yeah, it's really amazing what has, it's in, sort of in the last decade, yes. what has transformed in Pittsburgh. There are so many places brewing beer and really interesting flavors. And starting right out of their garages. No yeah. lie, starting right love out of that there. Because they're I love passionate it. about it. So passionate about it. I cannot tell you how long I sit and talk with these brewers and their passion. Sometimes I'm like, whoa, guy, like you gotta <laughs> slow down because it's, it, they're just, excited about beer and that's okay because I'm too. And what's the first one we're going to talk about? Hitchhiker. Hitchhiker. So okay. that one started out in Mount Lebo but mm -hmm. they also have this location in Sharpsburg so they just opened this huge warehouse location. What I love about breweries too not only do they have beer but Yelpers talk about how family friendly it is. So parents like to go and right. have a beer too and obviously you can't always get a sitter so what's nice is these breweries really invite everyone in and I really Where you love feel that. that. You that feel it's cool welcome. To, it's okay to bring the kids. It's okay it's to have right. a baby at the bar I always right. like to say yeah right. just <laughs> no no beer and baby right. mixing but yeah it's really good in this sense so Hitchhiker has a lot of really great brews. Okay, what I is love it? so this one I love to the canning so the owner actually designs the cans himself. Oh, the that's art cool. is yeah. so amazing so this is a Pilsner. I always say Pilsners are kind of like the friendly drinking beer. Is it okay? Um, I'm gonna try it. Yeah go for it. I want you to try this one so they said that they kind of uh, oh, like, like to brew yeah. culinary inspired brew. So this one's a mimosa. I've seen them. I know, right? Your eyes lit up. So wow. this is a mimosa beer. Yeah. But it's and, a beer. Yes. It's a beer. And you can smell the orange okay. juice. Is it smells so oh, good? Oh yeah. It kills oh, me. Oh, this so, is so neat. Right. So okay, I'm trying they, this too. Go for it. I like this, Rachel. I know. <laughs> I'll be here all week. Uh, or I should say weekend. We're kicking <laughs> off the weekend, right? That's that's great coconut lime one too so they really try and play off of food flavors which I, like I love yeah. yes makes sense what's up next so we have couch brewery so which I've been there yeah oh, have very, you? and it's like chill. retro I like it. chill yeah. I love the vibe and it's funny because I remember a lot of these brewers too from going to Big Pour so mm -hmm. that's that huge con construction junction event right. beer event that Everyone. And these brewers, again, started in their, their basements, their garages. And so the Couch Brewery has a retro fit, feel. Mm -hmm. And then with Yelpers, over and over again, all they talked about was the bingo. The bingo, the bingo, the bingo. So they have bingo on Wednesdays, and then they're doing drag oh. bingo in two weeks. Drag bingo. Oh, that's and fun, And look at too. these groovy cans. I love them. They're yeah, so the 70s. Yeah, the design on these. I know. And this one, actually, I don't what is need this? the board in the glass. No. It's a jalapeno. Oh, here. no, I, I detect some of that. You're some, like, something oh, in the I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> um, All right, what's next Up for next, 412 Brewery. So this is, I would say, the newest kit on the block. So mm -hmm. it is in, literally, you can see here, it's a tiny microbrewery. So it is oh. uh, only in the small shop on the north side. It's actually an old laundromat. And they started <laughs> in a garage in McKee's Rocks and then opened this tap room just in the past uh, couple months. And so with microbreweries, they're really tiny brews, so they don't serve a lot. But mm -hmm. seriously, in the summer, their outdoor area looks killer with like fire pits. And I just love this is a toffee, mm -hmm. so you can smell okay. the burnt toffee flavor in it. Oh, I'm just going to taste it. I mean, go for it. Uh, isn't it good? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's nice, too. I, I love know. this. This is very educational. Right I know. Too. I right. try. Where are we going um, next? Okay, so burgers. <laughs> so with these next two, I like to mention that they are not known for beer because with burgers, they just started brewing two years ago. And so I want to get the word out. They brew their own they beer. Because I've been there. I've had their burgers. Did not know they brewed the yeah, beer. Yeah, so for two years, they have about 10 beers on tap. They're actually opening a new location in Zillianopal. Okay. Uh, or Zilli for short. I always like to say that. Zilli. <laughs> The cool um, kids say Zilly. The cool kids, yep. yeah. Uh, so then they also, of course, have burgers that pair nicely with it. But I love the idea of doing flights. So you can mm -hmm. get for uh, $9 four different samplers of beer here. Uh, and so these little glasses are their, their sampler flights. And I love that they uh, name 
the beers, like all of the names are so inventive and cool and they really put thought into it. They like to associate it either with a local Pittsburgh or something mythological, mythological, mythological. oh my gosh, <laughs> I need to like go back to school. It's, no, no, I'm it's educating a, it's you. It's Friday, come on. All right. <laughs> I know, what have I had here? Um, mythological. All right, and what's, what's next over here? So the then we have here Mindful Brewing. So oh, okay. Mindful too, it's food you think first, but they actually mm -hmm. brew their own beers and they have 50 beers on tap from all over they have over a thousand bottles and what I love about mindful too is they just came out with these cans so you can take it to go in their bottle shop mm -hmm. and they are on no weight so Yelp has the no weight system which you can virtually get in line so literally you can be sitting on your couch right and get in line virtually and put yourself in a virtual line and then it'll tell you notify you when you're up so you could leave your house That's when you're so up slick. and just walk on by everybody yeah. else and get sat, enjoy like some. Like you're a VIP. Uh, totally. And yeah. you can enjoy some great beers. They have a lot of great ones there. And uh, enjoy some food, too. Well, this is all great information. And for more information on other local beers to try on National Beer Day, or really any day, oh, check out Yelp Pittsburgh. And thank you again, Rachel. Of this was great.